Australia. It's um, winter, so a lot of people come up with um, different excuses um, as to why they can't train. And admittedly, it's a lot harder, I have to say. Um, also, it doesn't help with, in Sydney especially, there's been so much rain. I've never seen it so wet in my life. It's been like crazy wet. Um, so, you know, I don't generally um, get my clients to train every day. We need to make sure that we're having rest days um, so we can recover. So on our days when we're not training, so we might be outside and going for a walks. Now, it's a, I know that it's not as inviting um, going out for a walk when it's raining. Okay, so what we need to do though is we just need to be more prepared. So that might mean that we need to rug up more, we need to invest in a raincoat. Like after all, it's actually only water. It's not, we're not gonna shrink or anything. You know, it's a little bit different if it's like a full storm or something. But you know, in that particular case, we can always do some hit training. So that can involve like some burpees, some squats, some push-ups, um, some squat jumps, lunges, anything you can imagine. And you can just do that in like a sequence and that can be done at home. So, and you can just be do, and you can just do 15 minutes and that will help you. It's all about making that commitment, okay? And that's what holds people back. They keep on coming back with excuses as to why they can't do it. But if you really want to achieve your weight loss goal, you have to commit and you need to make sure that every day you are moving. So what I recommend, and I've said it many times, is make sure that you put in your calendar when you are gonna train. So that also involves your walking, okay? So make sure that if you've got your strength training days, um, maybe with possibly some HIIT, um, and on, the, on your rest days, we don't wanna be actually resting. We wanna make sure that we have, are including some sort of movement, like I've been saying, like walking, or a little bit of HIIT, just a mini HIIT session, we can always do something. And when we're committed and we actually document what we're gonna do, this is when we're gonna see the results. So it's super important to do this. So my question always is, are you really committed to that goal? Like, do you actually wanna lose those 20 kilos? Um, and if you do, if you seriously want to, you're not gonna make up excuses. You're just gonna get up and get it done. And it's the work that we do when we, on those crappy days, when it is a shitty weather, or when you're not feeling up to it. So that this is when you're gonna see the results because you're being consistent and you're progressing. It's when we keep on having days off and making up excuses, um, that's why we don't end up um, reaching our goal. So I know this is like a little bit of the, little bit of a hard talk this morning, but I think, you know, people really need to know that we do need to make that commitment, just like in a relationship or just like, you know, when you've got a, a child, like you have to actually do the work. Otherwise, you know, your baby's not gonna survive. So, you know, we don't necessarily wanna be changing nappies and getting up in the middle of the night, but you have to do this for the baby to survive. So just think about it. Um, if you really do need to lose weight and there are just so many health benefits to losing weight and you need to really think about those, especially once you're over 40, you really don't wanna be mucking around anymore. And you need to think about, you know, this is this is about making it a lifestyle. And once you realize it's just a lifestyle, you can do things to um, help you enjoy it. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful. I know it's probably a little bit hard on a Friday, but I just wanted to just, you know, talk some truths and just really, um, try to get to the point that we need to make sure that we are fully committed to, to reach our goals. So if you'd like a free health and fitness consultation with me or a copy of my free um, mindset book, either comment below or um, DM me and I'd love to either organize a time to catch up with you or I'll send you through that book. All right, guys, I hope everyone has got some fun plans for the weekend. So have a good one and I will see you next week. Bye.